good morning, good morning, everybody. Oh, Jesus. Okay, it's Thursday. All right. Oh, guess what I did? <laughs> Give me a second. If I can bend down and get it. Oh, I got it. I got it. <laughs> I have the biggest idea how this is going to look like, and I don't think it's going to look that great, but we're going to find out. <laughs> I don't know, the colors that I used on this, I wanted it to be more pinkish and and yellow. The tie dye, the bottles, I don't know, like they weren't coming out right. Do these things, do the, the tulip, the paint, do they like wear out? Like do they have an expiration date? Because this doesn't look right. Now we'll see how it comes out. Because <laughs> I was going to do it for, um, to have it ready for uh, another day. So we'll see if that comes out right. But I don't even know if I did before here. I think I did. So yeah, that's what we did yesterday. Didn't go out anywhere really. Did I, did I? No, I didn't. Um, I wanted to go to the store to see the yes. But uh, let's see if I go over here. I just hate going blindsided. You know what I mean? I forgot my cup. Ah. Okay. I don't want that much water in here either. So. Yeah, let's see. I don't have a lot, just a few things. Oh, I got it. A spoon already. I just put up about maybe a few minutes ago. How can I get around seven? Oh. Yeah, I don't have my granddaughter here. She stayed with her mom. So, yeah, she wasn't feeling good. Uh, oh, she has trapped her, um, she's been running, so she said her legs were hurting her, and amongst other things. So I said, okay, you know, yeah, but, you know, I, I tell my daughter, you just let me know, because, you know, I'm wondering what's going on, or she's not at school, and I, I don't know what to think. And I'm thinking, oh, she's at track or whatever, and she's not even there. That's scary. And I'm thinking she's coming home by herself, and uh -uh. she has to let me know. Okay. All right, so that's I got the sugar in there. I know yesterday or the day before. When we have the sugar, it tastes awful. <laughs> okay. And I'm slowing down the sugar. I'm trying to eat a little bit, uh, you know, trying to eat a little bit more healthy. I'm back on the oatmeal. Oh, this is not here. I always get confused with this, these because these are like. These are different than the other knives, and these are really, really sharp. Okay, I'm missing one. That means it's in here somewhere. I think. Ouch, sure is. And you can tell. And you can tell they're not like, you know, they're not rounded. They're more like flat. They're more like flat, and these are round, kind of. These guys are flat. And you could tell. Like I said, these are really sharp. Okay. Now that's getting done. I can't wait for the, uh, what do you call this shirt to be done today? Let me do it later on, make it around six or seven. We'll see how it comes out. I'm probably just gonna have spaghetti today. That's about it. Make it simple. And then 
and then, I don't know, we'll have, probably have more chicken tenders tomorrow. Okay. And I think that's it. <laughs> Not really much to talk about. I'm done listening about the world. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Don't know whether Kate Kate Middleton is alive or not. Nobody knows what's going on. It's just the whole situation is just so weird. So so weird. Let's go. Don't know what happened. Maybe they had a fight. And maybe who do you call it ended up, you know, doing something or hurting her. And, you know, who knows, who knows, you know, I'm just, I, I'm just assuming, you know, so I don't know the facts, but I got some, I got, I have a feeling something bad happened, they're trying to cover it up. We'll see, we'll see. doing the same thing like start, starting the trafficking uh, young girls and stuff like that and I don't know. Don't know what's going on with that neither. I guess we'll find out in the long run. And then they never they never talked about what happened to that young couple. Remember that young couple that got killed? And they killed the uh, the, the teen mom was pregnant and they killed but Soto, something Soto. Don't know what happened to that case. We don't talk about it no more, so we don't know. Yeah, not really much in the news except that uh, I don't know what's going on with Trump. Yeah, he's going through all these, you know, things with, uh, I don't know, not even picking out what he's going through. And I don't know if they ever did, um, what do you call it? What was that? If they ever sacrificed that cow on Passover, which I don't think they did. Because I, I don't, it's like, it's something they shouldn't do in the first place. So it's like, yeah, you, you're off your rocker if you, if you plan on even doing it. If you didn't do it, I'm glad. But if you plan on doing it, don't do it. Don't do it. It's like, I don't know. It's like something, I mean, like, God doesn't need you to sacrifice anything anymore. We already did one. You sacrifice his son. That was it. You don't have to do anything else. That's it. But, um, then I determined to do it or something. I don't know. But I'll talk all about that on Faith Night Friday. I'll talk about that tomorrow. Because today, today on my board, is jewel is it jewelry making? No, it's card making. It's card making. But for jewelry making, um, I am going to make an attempt to do wire. So I saw this image, and I said, you know what? I want to try that. I want to see if I can do it. And it's not going to be easy. They're going to be earrings, of course. Um, do I want an ear, two earrings and a cup? I don't know. We'll see. But for sure, they're going to be earrings. And they're coffee cups. Remember how, I don't know if you've seen, they have these traveler ones. And uh, but they use them for paper clips, like paper clip, clip traveler mugs. They were really cute. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. And me, I know. I think, I think I even have a couple. But I know me, I'll probably lose them. I really don't use uh, paper clips that much, except for the when I do my crocheting. <laughs> that's when I use them. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> okay, buenos dias a todos. Hi, good morning everybody. Um, if you're new here, my name is Emma and welcome to my channel. Um, yeah, so still trying to get to that cake. We have about, I don't know, maybe 17, 16 more to go. So <laughs> really want to get, make that cake for you guys. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, so it's already going to be 8 o'clock. This is going to have to be a short one because I have to get my son, my grandson ready. And I usually don't, man, I used to do so many things that I don't do now at my age. You know, like, get, you know, wear a lot of makeup, wear heels, get dressed, you know. I don't do that no more. I, you know. It came out okay. It's not as sweet as I want it, but I guess I'm trying to cut down on the sugar salt. Yeah. Oh. So, yeah, I mean, even even going to the bathroom, my God. At my age, I'm like, I'm constantly going to the bathroom. I'm like, oh, I just want. Jesus, how many times do I have to go to the bathroom? And it's just, you know, I don't know, maybe because I'm drinking a lot of coffee and I constantly have to go. I don't know, because I have been drinking a lot of coffee, but um, yeah, but this is in the middle of the, of the middle of the night, so I'm like, what the heck? But uh, yeah, your body, you know, we go through changes, especially women, we go through a lot of changes with our bodies, so, I mean, men too, but you know, it's, uh, it's annoying, but anyway, yeah, I don't, you know, I don't, like, no, I just, when I take my grandson, I just like, well, I have to take him all the way this time because my, my granddaughter's not him. She usually takes him um, further, you know, uh, after they cross the, the patrol guy. She takes him from there because they go in like, he, she, she goes in this way and he goes in, in, into the building that way. So they disperse and they go like that. And I always make sure she takes them further away, and and she I always tell her make sure he gets close in the building. She always does, so because she's older, she walks home by herself from from school too, so she's old enough. And uh, but today I have to walk him all the way. So, but just the idea of putting the makeup on, and you know I just brush my hair, put a little bit of makeup on, that's it, and I, I'm gone. Before you know, I used to I don't even wear earrings anymore. I, for one, you can't see my earrings when I put them, I put them on because of my hair. And I don't do nails because I used to do nails all the time too. And I got tired of that. And mostly because I wash dishes all the time. And I don't like wearing gloves when I wash dishes. I, don't, I used to know this one lady. She used to, what do you call it? This was decades, decades ago. And she used to have beautiful nails like all the time, you know. And, but she always wore gloves to, to do her housework and all that. And I was like, yeah, I ain't going through all that. That's just, no. I mean, yeah, it is, you know, it does save, you know, um, it prevents your hands from drying up for sure because you're using a lot of soap and stuff like that. But, you know, these days they have soap that doesn't really irritate or dry your skin so much anymore. But, um, yeah, doing all those things, you know, it's like, I, I'm done with all of that. I'm like, I, I don't like, I don't mind looking presentable, but I'm not going to go like way out there and look, you know, get all dressed up, all gussy out, like if I'm going to go out for a night in the town just to do laundry. To me, that doesn't make sense at all. I used to see women like that too. I mean, they come to the laundromat and they're like, uh, and, and, it's not Friday night. <laughs> you know, like what the heck is wrong with you? <laughs> but uh, yeah, people we do we do the strangest, strangest things. <laughs> anyway, again, thanks for a happy night. Thanks for um subscribing. And yes, I'm talking to you. Thank you for subscribing. And uh yeah, so don't forget to like, comment, and we will catch you in a bit. And we'll see how that shirt comes out tonight and I'll show it tomorrow. I'm hoping, I am hoping that the cuts, they kind of look dark. I'm hoping it'll lighten up once I rinse it out. We'll see what happens. I t did touch up my card. I'll show you that tomorrow. I did touch up my, um, my pop-up card. And, oh, 
Today is craft night Thursday, so I think I showed you the bag that I made, and I'm going to show you what I made it out of tonight. Okay, guys, we'll see you in a bit. All right, I'm going to try to do this quickly because it got cold out here. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Um, I was looking at the clips I did when I went downtown. And for some reason, I don't know if you guys saw it, but I tried to um, show, what was that called? The um, the marquee on the Chicago, um, what was that called? The Chicago Theater? But I don't know if you guys saw it. If not, that's okay. I'll just take another picture of it. Or I'll take another clip of it next time I go downtown. Because I do want to hit Macy's. I haven't been in there <clears throat> for the longest time. And I really want to go in there. Um, do I want to go to the Walnut Room? I don't think so. I don't think I can afford it. <laughs> but <clears throat> I would just like to go in there and walk around. I've been wanting to go like ever since I was like 7, 8 years old. But, you know, I live in Chicago. You kind of think I would have been there by now. But, no, never happened. So, do I want to go now? No. I really don't care for it now. Like, sometimes you want to do things when you're young. But then, when the opportunity arises. Or, you know, you felt like, oh, I should have done that. It should, you know, been ha had, had to have happened, like, years ago. And it did it. I don't know. It just leaves, like, a sour feeling in your mouth like forget it i don't want to go no more like I, i'm already at the, this age and i don't care to go anymore and it, it pisses me off i'm like no i don't want to go no more i had the chance the opportunity and if i wasn't able to go then i'm not going now and yeah it just gets me upset that i wasn't able to go when i was young so why even bother now why even bother so i really don't care ah <sighs> yeah I'm getting mad. <laughs> but, yeah, I'll just go check it out. It's like one place I think I will go and do it just because I feel like it's something I always wanted to do. But at the same time, I don't even know if it'll be open. And that's to go to the, the old ice cream shop at the Science and Industry. Now, I always been, well, I went there one time and... I really felt bad because we went, I went with um, kind of like a church group and we all made it like uh, a mission for all of us to go to the science and industry. It was only a few of us, maybe like five women. And we all went there and the daughter, no, the mother of a daughter that was with us, I think she'd been wanting to do that also. I think she had like the same feelings I had. Like she always wanted to go there. And the opportunity arose that we went to the science and industry. But for some reason, um, all the other girls, when we got to the old ice cream shop and she was so excited, she was like, oh, it's the old ice cream shop. Let's go in. Let's go get some ice cream. I always wanted to come in here. And the other women didn't want to go. Why? Because, again, it was too much. And I guess they felt they couldn't afford it. But this was something that she had been wanting to do, like, for the longest time. And I could see and I go, oh, wow. I wish I would have bought some money or more money with me because... This was a dream of hers and we shot it down like and and it was like, oh no we can't afford it. they go no we're not going there and like just bam you know <laughs> like wow i felt so because i knew how she felt i've been wanting to do this and i knew what you know i knew we were gonna go and i knew i wasn't gonna be able to afford it there so i know we were just gonna go by and walk the old town street and see the old town ice cream shop I knew we weren't going to be able to to go in there but I knew how she felt and I felt so like so bad so bad for her you know but uh yeah you know that's how I how I feel sometimes I'm like yeah I want to go but do I really want to spend that much money for and to spend you know who knows ungodly prices for something 
you know, that's not even worth all the hype or, or you know what I mean? So, <laughs> no. Will I take my own lunch when I go to the science and industry? Of course I will. <laughs> eat, eat in the cafeteria downstairs. <laughs> if, you, if you've been to Chicago, you know how it looks like. <laughs> Especially when you've gone on all those field trips. But, um... Yeah, I've, I've been to the museum and, you know, the science and industry when I was a kid because of the field trips at school. But I've never been to the aquarium. The only aquarium I think I've ever been to, and that was the one. It wasn't even the aquarium. It was at Brookfield Zoo. And um, it was the dolphin place, you know, where you see the dolphins. That's where I went to. I think I did go to the aquarium maybe one time, I think. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, Macy's, that's my next stop. And then of course, I'll be going downtown and then checking out other, other places. Like I really wanna hit Garrett, the popcorn place. Definitely will buy something there. <laughs> and um, other places that I wanna hit, Michigan, Avenue, the water tower. Um, you know, I, I would love to go to uh, the American Girl, you know, but I think it's a little bit pricey as well, but just to check it out. And uh, let me see, there's so many places in Chicago that you can go to and I want to try to hit them, try <laughs> to hit them this summer. Well, we'll see. Guys, I got to put my hand in this other glove. I tell you, I got my my winter coat on i mean like really cold out here no sun and my fingers are almost like i'm gonna have to thaw them out when i get in the house <laughs> hold on so she's wait sweetie wait wait let me shut this off real quick and then I'll, I'll 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 concentrate on you hold on okay guys we'll see you in a bit
Okay, guys, so today on my board is uh, paper crafts. So I'm going to be working with uh, paper bags, um, brown paper bags. So you're just going to have to wait until I work with it. Also, I'm going to try to finish working on my card, the one that I did last week and or some time ago what was i doing for oh i was doing embellishments for um for craft night thursday was it craft night thursday did i say is that what i said <laughs> yeah i'm gonna have to write that down craft night thursday although i am saving the paper bag for craft night thursday but I just want to, you know, get a jump start and see how I'm going to do it so I can show people what I did. So I'm going to make one and then I'll save the other bag for for tomorrow. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. So today is paper craft. I did make my um, my banana bread. It came out so good, guys. It came out really good. I am really so, so happy of how it came out so okay so this is what i'm eating right now so i let me see so here we go i still have my coffee it's still warm but i am gonna um warm it up a little bit more so let me move this so i can show you what i have so we are definitely having oatmeal right now i was thinking of putting butter in there where did I see where they put butter in oatmeal? Or was it cream? I don't remember. Anyway, and I have some whipped cream. I need to get, uh, I want to make a lemon, a lemon, uh, a meringue pie, but a lemon meringue pie. But I also wanted to have like cream too. So I'm, I'm working on that for, I think, I don't know. When is lemon for, for the summer, for, for June? So I want to be making a lot of lemon dishes. Okay, so then we're having the oatmeal. This is my woody cut. I don't want to tilt it too much because I have the glass. Let me just put this over here. So there's my banana bread. It came out so, so good. We're having, of course, uh, an egg, a boiled egg with uh, paprika. And, of course, my favorite, my pickle. So that's what we are eating right now. And I am going to start... I couldn't find my little plate uh, to put my my banana bricks. I just wanted the plate and the banana bread, but then I couldn't find a plate. I go, wait a minute, I have a plate. I have a plate with the top. This is the one that goes to the bottom of the of the top that I have, which I'm still trying to work with. Because um, I wanted to get a nine inch. This is, I think this is a nine inch. I don't know what size this is. I got to figure out what this because I wanted a bigger one because I cannot plate a lot of stuff in here because when I close the top, it smushes everything kind of. I don't know. I don't and I don't have a plate that fits big enough for here. So I have to work on that. OK, so, yeah, this is what I'm eating. And without further ado, guys, actually, I was supposed to do this. Not this. I'm surprised this didn't fall. So without further ado, I am diving in and we'll see you in a bit. All right. So here we are. Another day. Um, so today is paper crafts on my board. And um, this is what I came up with. This is like a little purse. It's so cute. Now, the only problem I have with this was... Um, trying to figure out how to put the handles on without putting this cardstock on top of the handles. So I had to take the handles apart and then re, re put them on, on the purse. Cause that's what it is. It's basically, you know, just, just a little, a lot, a, like a little pocket purse. Anyway, this I'm not even done with because it's like, I can do so many things with this. It's incredible. I mean, I could put little pockets on here. I could put some wording down here. I could put some bling on the handle. I mean, there's just so much that I can do with this um, with this purse. Um, 
still. But um, I'm not done with paper crafts today. I still want to work on my card. I want to see if I could put some white, either white cardstock or ribbon, and maybe put like a rug underneath the, the mirror. I don't know. I'm still working with it. I like it. I just think it, I just don't like the be the yellow background, but I'm going to keep working with it. Um, so if you want to find out what this bag is made out of, because it's the same look in the back, um, it is paper, but if you want to find out what it's made out of, then you're just going to have to go and come back to my channel tomorrow night, because tomorrow night will be Thursday night crafts. And I'm going to be showing, you know, uh, what I used to make this and how I put it together. So if you want to join me tomorrow, don't forget to hop on and uh, I'll show you exactly what this whole bag was made out of. Okay, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.